And then you've made no secrets of your feelings of what this competition brings. Would it be big to try and stay in there tomorrow if you can? Yeah, it'd be massive. It'd be massive. We know what we've got to do. That's the, that's the main thing. And, and hope that other fixtures go, other results go our way. But, you know, it's, it's three games that we've looked forward to right from the start when it was, when it was drawn out the hat. And then we're coming to the last swim and, and we hope, you know, we hope to hope there's more, more to come. You said that now with zero points, but it could have been totally different, couldn't it? Yeah, the, yeah, that's the that's the thing. That's that's the big thing. The performance at Bradford earned, earned more. We well, we thought we'd have got we deserved more, but you, you end up with nothing, and that's that's the name of the game in there. You know, it's not sometimes it's not about the performance. It's just making the right decisions and doing the right things at the right time, and actually getting the getting the points by hook or by crook. And could that be the good thing for the young players who having that sort of experience coming away from a game, a competitive game, feeling hurt? Yeah, definitely. I mean, but again, it's 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 how they how they go about winning games. There's more, you know, the, the, you know, we want to play football, and, and the, you know, the academy mission statements passing through the thirds and bits and pieces. But sometimes a good old-fashioned route one and a cross comes in, and even if it goes off someone for a known goal, you take the goals and you take the wins wherever they're going to come. And this is this is that situation. You've had the benefit of having one or two senior players in those games with them. Are you hoping to have one or two helping them out tomorrow? Yes, I'm hope so. I mean, we've had Charlie and Charlie and Munez, They've helped us, and, and now I spoke to the manager. And potentially we spoke about Peter Crouch uh, and Bula, Jaren Bula, um, Bojan and, and, and Munezu again. So, um, but you know the manager's given it some thought. But I'm, I'm hoping that if we can get that calibre of player, even a couple of them, you know, they'll help the young boys immensely. It can only be a good thing for the youngsters playing alongside those sort of players in a competitive game, can't it? Yeah, but sometimes they've been a bit quiet today when they train. When they go and train with the first team or a number go over the first team, they seem a little bit quiet, a little bit in awe. Um, but you know they're here on merit. They're good young players, and we just need them to show a bit more personality and stick their chests out and sort of scream, "I'm here!" You know, this is what this is the player I am. Uh, look at me, sort of thing. So you know, it's, it's it's a bit of an experience, and hopefully they can grow from it. The manager's already shown that he's prepared to look at what you've got on offer and, and take one or two into the first team with him, hasn't he? Yeah, well that gives everyone a, a boost. Yeah, all the way through the all the through the academy, and even more so the players. If the young players can see their mate coming through, then then obviously why why can't they do the same thing? So gives everybody a lift if we can actually get someone on the park on the pitch that would be that would be even great um, even better sorry so you know that's the, that's what we're all here for Julian and Thibaut two standout ones at the moment what what are they doing so well that maybe one or two of the others aren't at the moment well Thibaut's uh, Thibaut's a goal scorer and making goals um, and he's been a threat he's been a threat all season um, and he's, he's you know he's done well and he's, he stepped up with a Belgium under 19 so he's playing a year out of his his age in the quality in the Euro qualifiers uh, Julian again has scored goals uh, he's been another one. He can go past people and make a goal from nothing. Uh, immense talent, strong. And the good thing about Julian is, you know, he, he's fit and strong, and he, he's had a few problems. But since pre-season, he, he's got stronger and stronger, and fitter and fitter, and, and, and that's been key for him. Those two players, with the possibility of Bojan and Crouchy, you're going to need goals tomorrow night, and hopefully they can provide that for you. Yeah, it'll be great if that's the if that's the front line. Blimey, I'll, I'll take that. So I'll sleep well tonight if I if I know that's the front line. Yeah, looking forward. You want this competition. You want. Under 23 sides to remain in it, don't you? Yeah, yeah, and I hope the players want it as bad as I do, because then, you know, then, then I'm sure we'll be okay. But yeah, I've, I've mentioned it right from the start. I mean, people are saying that we might not be the same next year. Maybe we need a tw an under 23 to go right through or up to the semi-final and and say no. By the way, the city we are here to stay. Um, you know, it's, it's at, the, at the start at the start of all this competition. I wouldn't have thought that the gates are high even before the 23s are in there. So um, you know, hopefully, fingers crossed, we stay in. If not, we're in it again next year. Do you know with Barry? Have you taken a lot of their games in recently? Yeah, I've got, I've got some reports on them. Um, they drew 2 2 at Wimbledon. They were 2 0 up at the weekend in the Cup, and Wimbledon pegged them back to 2 2. So, um, you know, that was a, a positive result for some of the results they've been having. But, you know, they're, they're, they're a competitive side. They want to come and uh, they want to come and they'll enjoy it and they'll enjoy the occasion as well so th they'll be up for it it's you know, the balance for them as well isn't it they they need a victory to guarantee progression yeah well, it's good yeah it's a, it's a it's a good um it's a good group you know so we've gone to the last game and and everyone you know Bradford obviously through but any of the other three can go through